Welcome back to Our Friend Games. My name is Chris, and uh, we're back playing Oxenfree. If you missed the first episode, one, it was a lot of exposition, but I will summarize this now. There is a lot of talking within this game. It's all voice acted very well, very amazing, but on moments of time, I will pause, just like I'm doing today, say a few things, and continue on. If I can speak without over-talking over everybody, I will. If not, whatever. First off, Clarissa, is she's a bitch, she hates us, I don't know why. Rin likes Nona, little girl with the blue hair, I kind of like Nona too, but uh, that's pretty much it. And Jonah is our new brother, and we have that's pretty much it, we'll continue on now. I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? But like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Clarissa, stop being a bitch. Hey, hey, let me go. Alex, you wanna check out the caves, or? Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. So I believe I was given a choice in this part where the where the thing come where on. choices <laughs> should be oh, oh, I forgot. Whenever we never you're ready. About John. Oh, what, their date? So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of one to ten, how weird's it gonna be? Hmm, probably a five. Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Okay, so again, with our fair, with our fairly clearly defined roles of um, the uber bitch Clarissa, Nona, the possibly shy but friend of the uber, uber bitch, and uh, Rin, we um, our first our first choice is upon us. Again, going into this blind, I have absolutely no idea what the fuck is going on. I do know that this thing has a bit of a supernatural feel to it, so uh, I'm trying again whatever but that something is irking me with clarissa not so much the fact that she's an uber bitch because uber bitch is well played well established whatever but there's something like there is something that is it, it's irking me there's something hidden within the dialogue hidden within whatever she hates me for a reason possibly for reasons of stuff and things and possibly i hope it doesn't get me killed Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Yeah, what's her deal anyway? I don't know. That woman's perpetually on her period. Uh... Ren! I'm standing right here! Oh. You know, I keep forgetting you're a girl. Thanks for, uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the, uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but, you know, you could've and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah, Ren. About Nona. What? Did she say anything? She didn't because say shit. if she said anything, you should tell me. Like, we're... Maybe you should just give her a little space, you know? Really? I thought you girls liked to be pursued. Uh, no. No, no, we like a challenge. We like something to catch. That's why they call it a catch. Oh, all right. I see where your head's at. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, I am... Yeah, the ceiling will be painted with our gray matter, I'm sure. Oh, wait. Actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Brownie Town. No. Magic? What does that mean? It's pot. It means they're enhanced with certain qualities. Hmm. Well, maybe just don't eat too much. Nope. The rule of the rule of thumb is if you eat one, eat a small amount and then wait until it hits you and then do not overeat them because it may take a while to get into your system but that shit will fuck you up even if it is just THC and how do I know this because I know a little bit about everything it makes it sound like I'm I do it but I might no I actually don't do it but I do know a little bit about everything enough to pass off as a, a pseudo whatever anyways yeah. Okay. So on the on that note, uh, um, in, in general, don't come on too strong, Grin. Like, 
It's cool. You like her. And unless you're the type to say, hey, no, no. Look, I know I just met you, but you're cute. And I would have totally loved to hang out with you just as friends. Maybe whatever happens in the future, we might ha- we might hang out. Maybe a bit more. But I just want you to know, no, no, you're adorable. Would you like to go on a date? Unless you can do that, which, let's be fair. First off, that sounds sleazy. Second off, I have no shame, and I have done that before. Third off, unless you have the wherewithal and the courage and the absent-mindedness to do that, for the most part, do not be pushy, because that just comes off as creepy. Especially if you just hang around and don't mention anything. Yeah. I do have done that. I've had a long life. I haven't had that long of life, but I've had things that have happened. Promises. Hmm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here and just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Is that SOS? Holy crap! What the fuck? Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. This is insane. What is it? What's doing it? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? (laughs) God. It doesn't make any sense. No, that doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then. Because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes, too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. Okay, so we had a moment. Okay, so while I was over here, we had the light aiming towards us. Now we'll check to see this one. I still swear that has to be Morse code for SOS. Come on. Come on. This is so cool. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they, they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? Uh, she dated my brother, who ca- Oh, you know what? Fuck it, listen. She dated Michael for five seconds, like three years ago. It was for a couple of months, a year and a half ago. Whatever, she never liked me. Not even then. I was always the little sister who got in the way, who she had to climb in through windows to sneak around. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... (sighs) Brownies are kicking in. Did that make sense? No, it did make sense. And you... you, They are expediting the uh, the brownie things, but... Anyways, um... That does give Clarissa a reason to... curious how did michael die this may seem this may seem a strange tra- a strange thought to to think about but is it possible that for some odd reason clarissa okay so that mike either died she clarissa either believes that mike died because of me and or she or that she was Dumped because of me. Kind of? I got it. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. And light. It sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... It sounds... Like... Painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? Well, that was definitely a thing. There's like... This is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous last... No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there. Like a giant rabies-filled bat. Or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's mm-hmm. check it out. It's not that far in. Yeah. <laughs> if it's a pool, that'd be cool. 
I um didn't mean that to rhyme. It totally meant it to rhyme. <laughs> cool pool. Cool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Bye. Wait a minute. Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here because I think shh, I think I mismeasured the magic. Yeah, don't don't mismeasure don't mismeasure the magic. That can definitely be a hazard. Now, I will say Nona, she is adorable. And Clarissa, well, <laughs> she might have reasons, but she's still a bitch is still a bitch, even with the best of intentions. So, fuck you. Jonas! Jonas! You know, how do they get... How do people get their... Their phones to hang on their shirts without, like, flipping over? Because mine... Mine are... My phones are too big, apparently. They kind of just fall out. So, we've got a quiet moment. Now that we can kind of sit and think. And this does bring us a choice. So I chose to go hang out with my new brother and Rin, who is currently, well, he's currently feeling the effects of magic right now. All right, just get down. Just let me, just let me, let me, let me get down. He's currently feeling of magic. And by the way, if you, if you haven't caught the, uh, the in intention, uh, magic is pot. Yes, it is the sticky icky, it is the edible. Uh, Jonas, I'm gonna friggin' kill you for this! And it, so, it's weird, I don't know if I would see everything, because it's only my, my, my radio that would able be able to hear this. So I probably could have gotten some dialogue from Clarissa and Nona, who, of course, would have just bitched me out for reasons of, just reasons. And is that a body? That better not be a body. Jonas, if you're dead, I'm gonna kill you. Why would a guy bring an ashtray down here? Or a pen? Wait. Ashtray makes sense, he smokes. The pen, however, is... Kinda weird? For story... Okay. See a man about a dog. Sure, will do. Are you okay? <sighs> Jesus, you scared me. What are you even doing? I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. But isn't this True. place incredible? I mean, I don't even know how this how this happens. No, it's uh, it's beautiful. It is very beautiful. Up until the point where shit starts See? in the fan. That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Not really. Kinda. I don't know where it's coming from. What could that be? Echoes? Sounds of the ocean bouncing off the walls? It's me. I failed geology. <sighs> there was a light in here somewhere. I still want to see what made it. <laughs> it must just be further in. Well, seeing as how I crawled in here to get you, might as well make the most of it. Yeah, and I mean, look... If it's cool, we can get the others. And if it's not, we'll just leave. Ah, uh, fuck it. Boink. Because at the end of the day, Rin's, get, Rin's gonna be useless, Nona's gonna be too scared, and Clarissa, well, I mean, she's... I, I may drown her if she doesn't turn in over a new leaf, okay? Come across some shit. We'll see what happens. Like, what is this made out of? Is it ice? I don't know. It's Pockets hilarious. of it are cold, but... Not, what? Wow, how is that? Did, did you see the floating, um, triangle light thing? You mean this thing? Um, yes. It, it must be like a, like a rainbow or like a reflection of light. Those, um, exist, right? Um, cave triangle rainbows? Yeah, let's... Sure, why not? Let's go with that for the time being. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there and the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I think that you tuned in this little guy somehow. I think it's all the same thing. Really? You think? 
Definitely. Try your radio. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like if it'll have an effect. Maybe, um, later. Come on, let's do it now. Seriously, we're right here. Well, I want to check some of this stuff out first. The glowing thing isn't going anywhere. It's true. I do because whatever the glowy thing is, it's a bit too um. Let's do it. Come on. No, shut up. Apart from the um, triangle, this is honestly the craziest thing in here. Like, how did it even get in? And I mean, aside from some like water damage, it's not really even that junky. I know. I uh, saw the man, but not the dog. Saw the man, not the dog. What the crap does that mean? A guy who can't see dogs. Did you see the first half? See a man about a dog? Yeah, I don't get it either. See the man about a dog. Found the man, but not the dog. Remember that we're gonna have to come back to it and I believe at this point we're gonna do something and it is gonna be incredibly stupid Possibly hilarious. We'll find out. Alex, really, I want to see what it's going to do. Shut up. Oh my god. Is this... Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Yes. Uh, I... I think... What is... what? Oh, cool. I know, I, I know! Where's... wait, wait. I gotta complete the triangle. Come on, come on, come on. Where is the signal? Where is the signal? That is a signal. And that... Is a ripped in, what in space. The Hello? Dear Ditto, everyone. Uh, hello. Sleepy. Kind. No. Everything. Fine. Holding. There. Same. Don't know. If. Leave. Is possible. This is insane. Uh, who. Are, are you... Who are you on the... Listen. Bob Tail. Shame Tail. Sleeping. Time. Time. Now. Is. Leave. Possible. Um, yeah. Sure. Leave. Possible. Bob Tail. Leave. Children. Bye. It is well. See you soon. Alex! <laughs> Oh, no, that's cool. Now that... Now that is the way you start a game. That's cool. Now the question being, are they ghosts? Are they friends? And Alex. what the fuck? Alex! In, the, in that order, by the way. 11 p.m. An hour has passed. Alex? Are you okay? You alright? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm fine. God. You sure? I'm as sure as I think I'm gonna be. Look, I'm just gonna cut to the whatever. Like, I don't know exactly what happened back there. But the sign says that's an old communications tower. And I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the party just... We can't leave without my friends, okay? You're... <sighs> Ren, sure, but does that list really include Clarissa? No, it... but I'm not Nona... i leave her, but I just want to get this whole escape thing moving. Uh... We can't leave anybody behind. They're here somewhere. This is not... this is not a thing. Okay, okay. Oh, enough... Pardon Tower. Oh, it's called that, I think, Oops. because the radio man who watched it, he was Major Richard Harden. 
I don't know why I remember that. <laughs> wait, wait, the guy's name was Major Dick Harden? <laughs> 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 yep. It almost makes the whole trip worth it, doesn't it? I wouldn't go that far. Okay, so... So, yeah. Um. So an hour has passed from the moment we came up here. I don't know where Rin, Nona, and Clarissa are. It is possible that they, they all could have came with us. It is also possible that something that they could still be on the beach. So we'll just go with that for now. We have no reason to expect otherwise. Now, so if you notice, it was it was speaking in broken jargon, but it was also speaking in old, like almost 1950s style songs. Bobtail, um, uh, gal, mother, coming. Uh, basically, all those were things I can remember or imagine that a song would have in the 1950s. I obviously haven't listened to all music for the 1950s, but I know of a handful of them. Still, it is a, it is a thing. It's weird. The armoire. I was curious in why it's here. So, let's look at the view. I can see the cave, but not Ren or anybody. What do you think happened to them? Hmm. Probably the same thing as us. Transmogrified or whatever to some other part of the island. Wait, wait. We're on a different part of the island? I, I know the door's locked. Locked. Let me try. Oh, after you. Oh, why, thank you. <clears throat> well, if you want to do things the easy way, sure. Yeah, I, I saw the window and I saw him. I was like, yeah, you're sure you can unlock it. But I can also. I, I was actually half, half expecting to be in the in the building when he came in. Okay, so let's go through a few things. We have the radio, we have thing? the machinery, we have the generator. The generator seems to be on. Machinery Warning, do not use aboard ship unsafe radiation limits. You know, I'd normally find this stuff kind of interesting, really. You know, normally. <sighs> you don't have to make me feel better about getting you trapped on Horror Island. Horror Island? Sounds a little different than what we're on right now. Why would you think I said Horror Island? Um... I don't know. <laughs> because when you say horror um, without leading that extra or, it does totally sound like Horror Island. Fence should be off now. Great, but um, don't take offense if I want to throw a stick at it first. Uh, I will take Well, offense. I will, and have taken offense at your not believing in my ability at flipping switches. <laughs> okay, now let's turn on the radio. Let's see how this works. Uh, SOS. Uh... S.O.S. Mayday, Mayday, um, CQD? CQD. CQD. Come quick, danger. Really? Yeah, no, I totally don't think they're coming. It's, um, dead. The radio's dead? Did you get anyone? I think someone was there, but I don't know. Okay, so we get some radio stations from the olden days. I swear that is an SOS. That by far it has to be an SOS. So weird. There's a dial tone, but there's a note here. Let's see what it says. Call out. Please dial station code for service. There wouldn't happen to be a code there, would there? Uh, nada. Nope. Nada. Okay. Uh, it seems we've exhausted. <laughs> ah, son Jesus. of a bitch. Hello. 
Hello? Alex? Alex? Is that- Yeah, it's me. Oh, Jesus hopping Christ! Thank Vishnu! I- You guys went into that hole and a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what happened. I just woke up like 15 minutes ago. I- I saw the light on in the, uh, the tower thing. Hey, did you know yep. that it's named after some guy named Dick Harden? Yeah. <laughs> it's still funny. Ren, still how funny. are you calling us? Phones don't work here. It's- it's a code written on this list here. But it's not a normal phone. I can't call out. I'm at, uh, the way station or whatever in the woods. It's been like, like, just the worst thing ever. Just DEFCON- Ren, are you alright? Like, physically alright? Cause I know mentally you're no, probably- No, I'm not alright! I mean, do I sound alright or do I sound not alright? I probably sound not alright, right? Wait, I, I, I think that's the other line. Maybe it's like a night watchman or something, or they do like check-ins maybe? Wait, Ren, someone's calling on the other line. Yeah, we gotta, Just, we gotta get all of our I'm gonna see eggs in a basket okay, first. Okay, but make it quick, seriously. Okay, so, yes. Hello? Oh, Jesus Christ, Alex? Why are you answering it? This, it says it's an emergency line. Where are you right now? Clarissa? And Jonas is with you. I'm oh. in the comm tower, Clarissa. Where are you? I, I don't know. I'm somewhere in Fort Milner. I don't know why I... I don't remember, like, the last hour. Yeah, that's... I'm trying to call somebody, but I'm in a room with radio stuff that can... It says it can contact Kamina, but I don't... I have no idea how Kamina. to make it work. Kamina, Kamina, can you Kamina. just come over here and figure this out with me? Yeah, yeah, sure. We'll be over there in a minute. Okay, just hurry, okay? There's, like... I don't know. I'm hearing stuff outside. Wait, wait. Where's Fort Nona? Fort looked huge on the map. Do you know where the... Where... And... We, okay, um... Okay, so, pause. We have... Uh, moments of... Okay, we were here. Discovery Cliffs. Alder State, we have not... Um, relay Point, I think, is where... Ooh, somebody's there. Um, radio Station stuff. We possibly have Bridge Stand, maybe somewhere. I don't know. We, we have a moment, and we have them... There, I think that's where we have Nina. Clarissa. No, no. Where we don't know where Nona's at. Let's go back out. And it dies, lady. Ren, are you still there? God damn it. Yeah, I guess that'd be too easy. You told Clarissa we're coming, so want to truck over to Milner first? See about that radio. I mean, Clarissa can be a handful, but gotta take the bitter with the sweet. Yeah, let's uh, do it. Yeah, if we can connect to the mainland and get somebody over here, we should do it as soon as we can. My thoughts exactly. Okay, yeah, we, we're we going to head over here, Relay Point, because it looks like we'd have to go in two different paths. I, yeah, I, unless there's, we'd have to choose either going right or left, and it's unsure if we even know if left is a thing, but w let's go here, okay? Judging by the way most games tend to work, possibly near the campgrounds is where we're going to find Nona. For guided tour, tune into radio station uh, one hundred two point three. Um, we'll remember that, mind you. But we'll we'll go to Clarissa only for the sake of maybe, if nothing else, we can guarantee, and she might be the one closest to us. Fuck her still. Right, our rescuing duties have officially commenced. Let's get this done and get off this rock like the badasses we are. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Righteous. Opening up 102. 102.3. Whatever. I'll meet you downstairs. Um, Jonas, you you okay up there? Oh, okay. Richard Dick Harden, who served as the tower's communications. Okay, 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 okay. That actually is inter interesting. Moments here. You see where the radio station. Including point to point from its receivers, microwave from its dish, Ka band for satellite reception, and military air band for nearby aircraft. Unique in its construction, 
The tower houses its office in a segmented platform directly underneath its antenna and dish. Once unceremoniously called Site 82, in 1980. With that, we'll be able to get some more information about the, the local area, possibly find some find some clues to where we're at. Maybe, just maybe, we'll be able to make it off this island without further ado. For, without further ado. Now, Jonas, if you would, throw the stick. All right, fine, don't throw the stick. All right. And we shall call that one for a day. I like it. It's, it might be a bit slow to start, but there are moments of... I feel like I'm watching The Goonies for the first time. On repeat views, it might not be as clever and interesting. But for the most part, I like it. It's cool. It is fun. How are you... Uh, doing. I'm fine, I guess. Why? Uh, cause everything's crazy. You know? So, just making sure your shoes are still on your feet. They are. They are. How are you? Uh, could be better. But we'll get through this and on to bigger and better? Good talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, we we shall call it a day for there. It's um, I like it. I, I I really do like it. It's it's fun. It's clever. In the meantime, we'll go ahead and take. We'll have a look at the map and figure out where we shall go next. We shall go help Clarissa. Since we know where where Rin is, we'll head there. But the moment, the moment we find out where Nona is, we are heading directly there. All right? Because no matter what, fuck Clarissa, save Nona. All right? Plus, she's adorable. And I am not, I am nothing if not a sucker for the adorable. One, two, three, four. Curious. One, two, three, four. There are four little dots and four little ways out. We can... This will probably be the central point where we'll have to come have to come back through here multiple times. I don't know how long the game is. Again, if you enjoy the content, leave a like. Uh, if you have a comment down below, I don't know how long this game is, so please, no spoilers. Um, let me know if I miss something. Let me know that. But if I haven't got to an area, please don't let me know. Not just yet. I do like going into these blind. And of course, if you and and of course and all I said, hit that hit that subscribe button because I will be. And you'll find more more games like this where you may not have heard of them. I will go through them blind, and we'll we'll see what happens. Thank you for joining me. I shall see you tomorrow. Later. Mm -hmm.